Hey everyone. In this video, I want to talk to you about how to avoid and get out of the friend zone. So this is usually something that affects younger people, but if you were constantly ending up in it while young and you never outgrew that behavior, it could still affect adults as well. So I want to talk to you about what causes it so you can avoid it. So the main thing here that leads to you ending up in the friend zone is usually you being dishonest. So what I mean by that is quite often people who get friend zoned like someone but they never tell them. If you never tell that person that you like them, chances are they may come to realize it over time but if it's early into your friendship or relationship with them, they're not going to know. They can't read your mind. So that's how you end up in the friend zone. It's just not telling the person that you like them. So the solution here is to speak your truth. It takes courage, but I can guarantee you that the risk of being rejected is far better than ending up in the friend zone. When you end up in the friend zone, it's almost like a slow agony. It's almost like torture. I've been there plenty of times in my youth and it was ridiculous and I put myself there by not being honest with the girls that I liked when I was younger. So it all comes down to speaking your truth. When you like someone, let them know. Tell them and invite them out on a date. And if they aren't interested, oh well, accept it and move on. Like I said, rejection is far better than the painful torture that is the friend zone. I would much rather be rejected a hundred times over than end up being friends in by a woman that I like. There's just, rejection is so much easier to handle because it's over and done with rather quickly. But the friend zone is something where you're stuck in it for however long until the relationship or the friendship ends with the person and you no longer see them. But during that whole time you're going to be pining for something more than friendship. And that's not good. So don't end up there in the first place. Speak your truth. Gain that confidence to be authentic because part of being authentic is speaking your truth, being honest. If you like someone and you don't tell them and you're hanging out with them and pretending to just be their friend, guess what? You're not being authentic because the authentic you would tell them straight up that you like them, that you want something more than friendship. And you have to relay that to them. If you never do, then you'll constantly keep getting friend zone. So just develop the courage to speak your truth and let them know that you like them. Problem solved. <laughs> I know that it's a bit harder to do than it sounds like many things in life, but just practice it. Start taking small risks towards rejection and eventually you'll find out that rejection isn't all that bad. It's much better than staying in the friend zone or ending up in a relationship that, or you end up getting rejected five years down the road as opposed to maybe the first time you meet the person. I'd much rather get rejected sooner rather than later so you can save a bunch of time. Because <laughs> if rejection is going to be the inevitable outcome, it's going to happen at some point. Sooner rather than later is always better. Anyway, I hope this video helped you and I'll see you guys in the next one. Arrivederci!